we are taking care and uh, looking at the children uh, of the, our citizens here in Judea and Samaria in the same way we are looking at our children anywhere else in uh, Israel. How do you explain that it's been so hard for them to build even before the actual construction phase? From the moment that uh, of the cabinet decision, it was clear in the decision itself that uh, the decision is not include education uh, system. We had uh, certain uh, arguments or disagreements about what should be built with the uh, security ministry. But uh, right now we agreed about what we are going to do in the next year. As a senior minister in the government, uh, what do you think will be happening the day after the end of the 10-month uh, construction freeze? It is in the decision itself that uh, after the time that is mentioned in the decision, we will return to build in Judea and Samaria not only uh, buildings for education, but uh, in all other aspects. Here we are marking the beginning of the building of a kindergarten, but this kindergarten had to go through all the authorization and the bureaucracy. What is your feeling here? I mean, this is, is this supposed to be so difficult? Well, it shouldn't be so difficult, but it is the reality that the unfortunate decision of the Israeli government about the construction freeze created. Uh, I must say that Minister Saar is doing a good job, a great job, in trying to advance uh, the plans to build and not to discriminate uh, the children of Judea and Samaria in comparison to the children of uh, the other parts of Israel. Uh, we also expect uh, Minister Saar to take the leadership in um, battling uh, the very notion that uh, political considerations, whether from the White House or the Kiria in Tel Aviv, uh, dictate uh, the educational possibilities of children of Judea and Samaria. The discrimination uh, is uh, unacceptable. Minister Saar understands it very well, but uh, uh, not everything is uh, on uh, his uh, capabilities, but we hope uh, he will take the lead in this very important uh, battle. He declares that after a few months and a few months as the construction fee ends, building will continue. Do you believe this? I hope. I hope it will uh, happen. Uh, it is very important also not just to say that the freezing will be lifted, but the freezing will be lifted without any discrimination between uh, Ishuvim, not only in the so-called settlement blo blocks, but all over Judea and Samaria it should be lifted.